Hey everyone, it's Quentin from QP Tech, and this is a look at the Mining Rig, which is a late game build for sure. Uh, it's a multi-block structure, which here I've built the minimum required. Uh, we have the core, which recipe I have to uh, sort out still. And I may add some other parts, uh, we'll have to see. But for now, just some of these iron frames and four steel machine hulls. And these are concrete. Actually, you could see if I break that, it's gonna show that it's missing blocks, just like the cementation furnace. And you can use uh, any of the colors of the QB Tech concrete. And then also, unlike the cementation furnace, I haven't put in enforced any empty blocks. So if you wanted to fill this all in, it doesn't care. Whoops. Actually, you can do this. You can fill this back in. Uh, the drill is one way. So it's going to start at one block under it, and it's going to dig out this five by five. And it's just going to keep going down. If I put blocks here, it's kind of just going to ignore that at this point and it'll just keep drilling away. So I suppose you could close up the top if you wanted, if you don't want this big open shaft. Uh, yeah, so the other thing you will need is a container on top. Uh, it doesn't have to be this uh, steel item hatch. It could be any valid container in the game probably want more than one slot because it can output a bunch of different things and if there's no container here or if this container it can't put something into it will stop you also need a bunch of flux I'm just gonna set this back today 128 which is substantial uh, you are probably not gonna want to try and run on primitive electric generators so in theory you could or you could maybe solar power it, but I'll do a separate video about that. So yeah. Uh, oh, the the minerals that you're gonna get are based entirely off of the uh, the re the same system that gives you your pro pick reading. So uh, if this was ultra high cassiterite, then it would output more. The odds would be better of it outputting as it goes. And I might adjust that as time goes on. I might uh, have it maybe go slower, but spit out more minerals the lower it goes. Right now, this will go down to Y10, and then it will just stop. So then you could come and move it. Uh, yeah, so this should be great for late game materials. Uh, eventually, I might add some way for a completely infinite, uh, maybe like a deep core drill. And I'll be adding some better power sources and such. And also there's the solar power, which I will go over in a separate video. Thanks for watching.